Breaking news first on CNN and a very unusual move. The U.S. targeting the cash of ISIS terrorists, bombing millions of dollars. Let's bring in Barbara Sarr live at the Pentagon, who is breaking this news for us. Barbara, what can you tell us? Good afternoon, Pamela. This happened in Mosul, Iraq's second largest city controlled by ISIS for months now. What is so unusual here, this building containing perhaps millions in ISIS cash was in the middle of the city in a civilian area, and the U.S. still bombed it. We are hearing so much, of course, about trying to avoid civilian casualties. What happened here is they got intelligence that ISIS was using this building to store cash, to pay its troops, to conduct operations but they knew there were civilians in the area. So U.S. planes and drones kept watch for several days, trying to calculate the best time to try and hit the building when there wouldn't be civilians there. And we are now told that two 2,000-pound bombs were fired against this building in Mosul at dawn yesterday. They do believe they destroyed the cash pile there. Why that's so important, of course, is it takes away significant resource from ISIS for its operations, its ability, if you will, to function as a state with all of those financial resources. 